There you go. Just keep going, give it. Give it and go. It's like nothing. So this is the cyber truck and it's actually the cyber beast. This thing is freaking solid. But what's nice is if you press this button here, it pops the door open, but you can't push it back in. So you can't really pinch yourself in this crack. And that's pretty thoughtful. And then so you just grab it, then you can easily get in and go. This thing just feels strong and just feels tough. And it's what a truck should be. But, you know, I've never had a truck before, so I thought it'd be really cool to actually talk to someone who's had multiple trucks and diesel trucks and see what his thoughts are on it. And maybe we can go take this thing out to the teams. First in Tesla, so. No worries. Andy, what do you currently drive? I currently drive an F350 Power Stroke. It's a big diesel truck. <laughs> what do you think about the Cybertruck initially? It's different. It's it's definitely different and not what I'm used to driving, honestly, when I'm towing something. The car has detected that there's a trailer behind us, so we just said, okay. We're uh, towing a Brawley. <laughs> it's crazy, because we're hauling, you know, 3,000 pounds of weight, and the region still feels just as sensitive as without hauling anything, so. So it's adaptive. Yeah, like there's no way I would be able to tell there's something back there, because even the acceleration doesn't feel like it's lagging at all. <laughs> Holy cow, that that's nuts. My truck has a lot of horsepower and there's no way I would accelerate like that. There's gonna be a lot of guys out there that love their diesel trucks and ho-hum about electric and all that and how far they can actually haul. But man, if you had a small company where you were running around with a, a trailer to different job sites, this thing can perform pretty dang well. I don't have a truck. I've never driven a truck until this yeah. cyber truck. I've actually hauled a million dollars worth of horses to Texas, so. Big long horse trailer, big dually truck. Um, getting somebody behind the wheel in this vehicle for the first time hauling a trailer, hauling, flat towing a vehicle, and getting a reaction would be awesome. This is definitely gonna be a new experience for me, but I'm totally willing to try. And uh, yeah, yeah, let's check it out. <laughs> oh man, okay, so Andy just convinced me to try and drive this thing, towing it, so we just pulled over. All right, Andy. Wow, okay, so I instantly see that there's literally, I don't feel like I'm pulling anything. I'm towing a Brawley now, which is an electric UTV that weighs like 3,000 pounds. I'm flat towing it, so I'm essentially pulling the vehicle behind me with the Cyber Beast. And also, that vehicle behind me is regenerating and charging, and so, we're like charging it up with regen while pulling it and it just feels like nothing. Like, am I officially a trucker now, Andy? Oh man, you could go on the ice uh, road trucker show now. <laughs> Do you think I could haul a million dollars worth of horses with the Cybertruck? I don't know about that, but <laughs> that's, a lot, that's a lot of horses. Okay, so, I'm gonna try and do a U-turn. Yeah, wow. That's wild. That's absolutely wild. Yeah, you did good. Thanks. <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> so, I'm gonna charge my battery for uh, the screen on the camera using this handy plug right here.
This video is sponsored by ScentWedge. We make all natural air fresheners designed for Tesla Model 3 and Model Y. Let's try it. Okay, so now we have to go to the screen, go to outlets, turn on this outlet, boom. So now it's on. As you can see, we're charging. I mean, once you're getting over 12,000 pounds, that's where you're getting into commercial contractor use, where you're hauling small, you know, mini X's or Bobcats. It'd be interesting to see how it would haul like a Bobcat on a small trailer. I don't think it would struggle too much, honestly. I think it'd be able to pull it pretty well. So people will struggle to find something big enough to really haul that you wouldn't then need like a diesel truck, you know what I mean? So Andy, will you be getting a Cybertruck? Hey man, it's a possibility. We'd uh, borrowed the a Tesla Model Y for a weekend and it was a lot of fun but I'm more of a truck guy so I would probably prefer a cyber truck honestly <laughs> so it's a yes yeah <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're just passing this vehicle <laughs> wow, <don't worry. laughs> oh. that was way too easy <laughs> it's gonna turn people people's opinions against them more for them. Definitely changed my opinion. <laughs> okay, so should we try the music on this thing? Let's do it. So all you gotta do is hit that button right there. That that scroller. scroller? Yep. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, my truck has a sub and premium sound and it doesn't sound this good. has a elevation audio is their new system and they used to use Meridian and I have the Meridian one and this is way better than that. The Meridian one's a little muddy. This is very clear and crisp. It's so crisp. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think Andy? Oh it's awesome. It sounds great. Yeah. That was pretty epic. You're not paying extra to get a sound system in this at all. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, no upgrading sound. Nope. How much more do we have to drive till we get to the dunes? Um, let's see. It's like a half a mile. So oh, sick. Once we get to that spot right oh. there, we'll turn left and then Sand Mountains over there. Beautiful. So. So we just we just towed that brawly here with the Cybertruck and charged it along the way using the regen because it's being cooled. And uh, now we're gonna go off-roading in these dunes right there, which is gonna be wild. So we turn off trailer mode. Now you go to dynamics, you can go to off-road, confirm. I think Baja mode is oh, wow. makes sense for here. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's do it. I think we're in it, right? Yeah, we're in it. Whoa. Handled that like a champ. Yeah? Yeah. That was awesome. <laughs> That looked effortless. Yeah, it was easy. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> 
That's insane. Whoa. Okay, that's cool. It's like nothing. Oh my god, this thing is awesome. I just like stepped on a little bit and just like felt it. It's all controllable. It's like my first time. <laughs> Super fun. That's awesome. gonna try uh, try the dunes here got the brawlies Andy over there and some other guys and we got Ryan Shaw as well he just did it so I'm gonna try it it's pretty fun all right here you go it's recording roll up the window dynamics off-road okay Baja California all right ready Did you have these cameras on? So, just took it up these dunes. It's not my car, so I wanted to be respectful, but uh, yeah, got to slide around in some soft sand. And this thing is a beast. So, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Philip, thank you so much for letting us borrow your truck. And uh, with that, I say, until next time.